guys this is Will and welcome back to another video today we're going to be taking a look at the uh, Pebble 2 SE uh, smartwatch so I picked this up from Amazon and right now you can pick it up for $54.95 if you're a Prime member uh, and I'll leave a link in the description uh, for it if you want to pick it up so uh, I want to say why I picked this up in 2017, knowing that the uh, they have sold out to Fitbit. Well, uh, let's get it out of the box. This kind of container come, box it comes in, and here's the packaging right here. Here's the box that is in. But I picked this watch up because I wanted a watch that would work across more than one platform. Uh, the iOS platform and Android platform and the original Pebble would do that fine uh, without losing a whole lot of functionality uh, here's my original one it died I bought this like as soon as it came out and it finally died on me so I did have the Apple watch and it specifically just worked for uh, for Apple for my iPhone uh, I do still use my Moto 360, but the Moto 360, when you're trying to use it with iOS, uh, you, it, it loses a lot of functionality also. So I ended up picking up uh, the Pebble 2, which is an updated uh, watch compared to the original Pebble. And uh, that's one reason why I picked it up. Now, I know that the companies are going to uh, sold out. Uh, Fitbit said they're going to support this. Uh, support the watches through the end of 2017 uh, and after that we don't know what's going to happen but for what I mainly use the, the watches for which is uh, notifications and a few other things that all of that will still continue to work even if they don't support it you just won't have uh, technical support and uh, warranty support so you know for $54 I'll take that chance because I I like the way the, the, the Pebble watches work. So here's the packaging that it comes in. This is the Pebble 2 SE. And as you can see right there, it works for iPhone or Android. Uh, now this watch came out April 2016, if I'm not mistaken. So it's not a new watch, but uh, it's one that I picked up and I just wanted to do an unboxing on it. Uh, these have great battery life, as you can see, up to seven days battery life. You get your notifications. Uh, this, you can see these very well outside. Activity and sleep tracker. This one also has the voice reply on it. And these are water resistant up to 30 meters. So uh, let's get in and see what it looks like here. And I had the I had the eye watch, uh, the Apple watch, and I ended up selling that watch. Uh, it was a great watch, but it was just something that I I really didn't like it too much, so uh, I got rid of it. And here, bonjour, hello, and that's about it on the outside of it right there. And on the inside of it gives you illustration on how to put your watch bands on there uh, you get some more paperwork here uh, there's this actually is some stickers that you can take and put place on something some pebble stickers that's pretty cool and then you have your uh, it's probably your warranty and uh, stuff like that paperwork uh, then on the inside of here it tells you what each button does and what they control right there. So let's see what else we get here. We get charging cable. Uh, this is a uh, this one is specifically designed for that. See it's magnetized right there. So get that to stay down right there. Let's get the watch out, take a look at it. And here's the watch. Wow, this is very, very light feeling compared to the old one. Do a little size comparison here. 
But th that's the charging cable right there. It's magnetized. And as you can see, pretty close to the same size, but uh, it's quite a bit thinner than the original one right there. So uh, let's see what else. You got your two bands right here. Let's see if I can get them apart. Oh, there it is. It goes like that. Now these bands have the little quick release uh, on them so you can get it, you know, take your band off and switch it up pretty pretty easily. So this is real soft uh, rubber right here. And then let's see what we got here. Uh, just saying about the accessories. So yeah, man, this is going to be uh, pretty nice right here. Kind of excited to have it because I kind of miss my my other Pebble watch. Now, like I said, I wanted something that will work easily between both platforms. If I want to have my SIM card and an Android phone today, uh, and then tomorrow have it in my iPhone, then I wouldn't have to. I could still wear the same watch. So, trying to get these together here. And I say it's easy. There it is. Oh. Live on camera, guys. But trying to do it behind the camera also. You just pull down on that little level there. And pop it in place. So there it is. That's the whole watch. All together. Pretty thin. Very light. Uh, see if it have any power to it. Yeah, it's got juice. Take this little stick off of it. So yeah, let's go around the, the watch right here. On this side, you have your power button. Uh, the other side, you have your buttons that, uh, for selecting uh, different menus and uh, things that you need to do on the watch. As you can see, again, this watch is very, very thin. Uh, on the back of it, uh, you have a little pebble branding right there. And this is these three dots right there. This is where your... Uh, where your charger goes, it's all magnetized, and as you can hear, it's pretty pretty strong uh, magnet on it. As you, you see, I'm trying to shake it and it won't come loose, so that's pretty strong. On this, they have have a little pebble branding also right there. Uh, so, and it's pretty long. Uh, I'm curious to see if my old one will work with this also. So yeah, man, that's a uh, that's a look around the watch right there. Like I said, this is. Pretty soft material, rubber right here. Uh, got some pebble branding on these two little guys right here where you uh, put your band in there. There's some pebble branding. I don't know if you can it can be seen, but nice looking watch, man. So that's it, guys. The Pebble 2 SE. Uh, like I said, I'll leave a link in the description for it if you want to pick it up. And... Uh, Thanks for watching. We'll catch y'all in the next video.